Hey everybody, it's Kneecap here, and welcome to This Week in WoW for the week of November 23rd. As always, we'll start off with the Mythic Plus affixes for the week. This week we have Tyrannical, Inspiring, Quaking, and Tormented. Again, that's Tyrannical, Inspiring, Quaking, and Tormented. Pretty good week uh, for pushing keys here. Inspiring is mostly about your group, but Quaking is really easy. Inspiring is definitely worse with Fortify than Tyrannical. Uh, and so it's actually uh, not a very bad week there at all for for keys. Uh, let's go ahead and talk about what's going on in the game this week. Now let's talk about what's going on in game this week. Uh, we do have the WoW 17th anniversary continuing on. I did a video about what to do for the 17th anniversary and I speculated that with the mount and uh, toy but mostly the mount drop changing to 100% that that might have some negative effects on the event and stuff and participation and it definitely did do that. Um, there's not many people doing it anymore. There were just thousands of people gathered around to kill the bosses and stuff like that. Uh, that pretty much all went to hell as soon as people could just get them out on their first try. I kind of understand there was a big outcry for them to make it 100% because they, you know, people, and I do agree, people shouldn't miss out on the mount during a anniversary event, for example. Uh, I think everyone should get it eventually. Um either i think you could have just locked it behind badges as well like if you kill it doom walker x amount of times so you get the 200 badges or 150 whatever it is for killing doom walker um and then you could just buy it with badges uh just something some in some way make it so uh there was a little bit more participation with it because it's kind of cool when everybody's grouped together i think i that's something i like when there's just lots of people grouped together doing things flying to ashara and uh flying to you know blasted lands and all that stuff to do these bosses and you know the participation really was killed unfortunately um other than that we do have uh pilgrim's bounty starting up this week so this is a obviously american thanksgiving type holiday um this is not one of the more produced holidays unfortunately there is some things to do but it's just not there's not a ton to do there's not a ton of rewards there is like a reputation bonus i believe which coincides with the wow's anniversary bonus or or stacks i should say with that you can stack them up together and that's kind of interesting for another thing going on and that's the uh that is the pvp brawl war song scramble so if you have any if you need to still have your war song gulch reputation maxed out or you know you just haven't been able to stomach it the warsong scramble in general is a really good way to do this with these reputation buffs it's going to be even more lucrative to do so either way with this reputation buff 17 percent, i think it i think it's 10 percent from pilgrim's bounty um with those reputation buffs you could really farm paragon chests you can do a lot of things with that uh extra rep it's it's very advantageous to do things that maybe you've put off doing uh for this week when you have all this extra uh rep coming your way that wouldn't normally be there we also have the shadowlands dungeon event the dungeon events are pretty much pointless i think they need to kind of rework how those how those work unfortunately so other than that there's not enough a uh, ton going on this uh in the game this week uh rating wise we are very close like i said uh uh I, I believe we would be very close to killing savannah we, we definitely are uh we're we need to learn the last platform a little bit and then but at pretty much any time wow uh, with a really good pull, we could probably kill her. So I'm hoping that's this week, but uh, unfortunately our second raid day is on Thanksgiving. So uh, we are not raiding that day. So we only have one night to do it this week, but uh, hopefully before this, uh, well, I guess for, hopefully before the mage tower opens, <laughs> Sylvanas is down. Uh, that would be my goal there. So uh, that's where we are with there. Uh, as far as PTR stuff goes, I, I did a lot of rep paladin videos uh, already. And, uh, you know, waiting on the PTR, that's probably not going to be until December as well, from what I was reading. So the PTR, actually being able to play on it and test some st things out on it, probably won't be until December. So uh, as soon as that does come out, I will be on there trying some stuff out, trying out the different legendaries and different covenants. Hopefully all that stuff is testable. Uh, that would be nice to test that out. So uh, that's what I, I will be doing as soon as I can on there, try to figure out what's the best thing for Rep Paladins. And yeah. Uh, that's about it for this video. Hope everybody who celebrates American Thanksgiving has a happy holiday. And other than that, everybody have a good one.